like this. Rattlesnake and mouse. It was evening in the desert. Evening is the time when the day is going to be finished, right? The day is ending. Uh, evening starts at uh, almost five o'clock, right? So mouse ran here and there looking for seed to eat. As you know, this story is based in the Sonoran Desert. So usually the nocturnal animals are living in the desert. Those who come out uh, when uh, the evening starts, right? During the daytime, they sleep. So as Mouse ran past a rock, he heard a voice. Help, help, said the voice. I am trapped under this rock. Trapped means that when you are stuck somewhere, right? So I'm trapped under this rock. Is that you, Rattlesnake? Asked Mouse. Yes, it's me, Rattlesnake. Please push the rock and let me out. Now Mouse, Mouse said that if I let you, let you out, you will eat me. No, I won't eat you. I promise. Right? And said rattlesnake please let me out okay said mouse mouse pushed and pushed until the big rock rolled over and out came the rattlesnake so in this first paragraph in this first part we have seen that it was an evening uh, there was a mouse uh, running from here to there and Suddenly he hear the voice, help, help, right? I am trapped under this rock. Who was this? It was Rattlesnake, right? Who was asking for help. So what Mouse said that if I let you out, you will eat me. So Rattlesnake said, no, I won't eat you. I promise. Please let me out. Mouse said, okay, mouse pushed and pushed until the big rock rolled over. I mean that, it, look, we can see here in this uh, picture that mouse is pushing the rock, right? So out came rattlesnake. Then what happened? Thank you, mouse, said rattlesnake. I was under that rock for a long time and I am very hungry. Hungry means when you want to eat something, right? So a little mouse is just what I need for dinner. So what he's doing now, he's breaking his promise because uh, the rattlesnake said that if you are going to help me, I will not eat you, right? Wait, said mouse, you can't eat me. I have just saved your life. You are a kind and fair animal, mouse smiled rattlesnake but i am not i am hungry rattlesnake and i am going to eat you just then coyote trotted by so coyote who is here we can see that this is coyote so she was passing the way and she just stopped mouse called out coyote please talk to rattlesnake rattlesnake was trapped under this big rock I rolled the rock over and saved her life. Now she's going to eat me? That's so unfair. Unfair means that when you are not doing something right, right? Kyote stopped to listen. What did you say, Mouse? Were you trapped under this rock? No, said Mouse. Rattlesnake was trapped under this rock, not me. So I'm sorry, I don't understand, uh, said Kyote. Did Rattlesnake push the big rock over? No, shouted Mouse. I pushed that rock over. Oh, I'm so confused, said Kyote. Explain it again, please. Did Rattlesnake save your life? This is ridiculous, said Rattlesnake. How can you be so stupid, Kyote? I will show you that what happened. So I'm going to stop the story here till the page number 43. Then tomorrow I will explain the next story. 
from uh, page number 44, right? And the last part of the story, and we'll also solve the questions and answers. So till yet what happened? that we have seen uh, there was a rattlesnake stuck trapped under the rock he's and the mouse was running there so he rattlesnake asked the mouse that uh, please help me i need your help i am trapped here in the rock if you can help me mouse said no if i'll help you you will eat me rattlesnake said no i promise that i will not eat you you just need to let me out the mouse did hard effort he pushed the rock he rolled over the rock this by pushing it again and again and when the rattlesnake came out uh, so he said now i'm going to eat you right but uh, the mouse said you can't eat me i've just saved your life you're a kind and fair animal mouse smiled rattlesnake but i am not I'm hungry and I'm going to eat you. Meanwhile, the coyote came there, right? And uh, mouse called out coyote that, please come here and help me. The rattlesnake is going to eat me. I have saved the rattlesnake's life. And now he said that I'm going to eat you. That's absolutely unfair. As we know that coyote is so sharp and clever. So coyote stopped to listen that. What did you say, mouse? You were trapped under the big rock. Mouse, is, mouse said, no, I was not trapped, but the rattlesnake was trapped. Then again, uh, Kyoto said, sorry, I don't understand. Did the rattlesnake push the big rock over? Uh, mouse said, no, I pushed the rock over, right? And then uh, Kyoto said, oh, I'm so confused. And explain it again, please. Did rattlesnake save your life? This is ridiculous, said rattlesnake. How can you be so stupid, Kyote? I will show you what happened, right? And uh, this is uh, at the end of our today's class. I hope you enjoyed it a lot as uh, the story is quite interesting. Right. So I'll explain the rest of uh, the story tomorrow, inshallah. Let me take your attendance now. So when I'll explain the story tomorrow, I'll finish it and uh, then we will see the questions and answers. So guys, you know, the time is up and I'll see you tomorrow, inshallah. Take good care of yourself. Have a good rest of the day.